What's up guys, it's Stealth here and I'm back in Resident Evil 3. I decided I'm gonna do something a little different. Let's see here. I don't know if I'm gonna stick with the handgun too much. But whatever happens, it's, like the, it's either the shotgun or the handgun's gonna get traded out. I'm not entirely certain what yet. Just checking the map. I'm a little nervous. Uh, let's see. Do I want to bring this with me? I think. I think that's the ideal thing right here. Let's do this. Also, where am I going? Right, that way. Because this door is unlocked. I killed all the zombies in here. No, I didn't kill all the zombies. I killed a few of the zombies. Where, where did I get them all? Oh, I got them all. How about them apples? Please insert a system disk to unlock. Dang, Nabbit. I gotta go get that system disk. Can't believe it. <laughs> that is the one thing I overlooked with the freaking system disk, but whatever. What I'm more confused about is why they didn't call it an MO disc this time around. Anyway, let's grab it. Still a couple things we have in our inventory that we just simply don't need. Let's go back after wasting a minute of our time just going back to grab a freaking disc. A large sized refrigerator. Claw marks that indicate something. Try to crack it open from inside. Let's not open that then, shall we? Alright, insert the system disc. Okay. Out 
get up, get up, get up, get up, get up. He is hurting bad. Get up, get up, get up. Use the card key. Get out of there. <laughs> Thank God. What's happening? I don't think that's a good thing. Whatever's happening. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. All personnel evacuate immediately. All right, where am I going? I want to try the room up there. I have a first aid spray left. It'd be really nice if I got a second one somewhere. Kidding me, right? Out of my way. Takes care of all those guys. at least try this. There's gotta be some stuff down here, right? I think. Well, hello. Is that it? What's behind this door? I have this. I can use this, can't I? And 
let me open it. There's gotta be something good behind there. Fine. Let's go the other way then. This way is right. That's a little disappointing. I wanted to see what I could open. Man. What does this facility key do for me if I can't use it for that thing? More. handgun. Two green herbs and a first aid spray. Anything in here? I'll take Magnum rounds. Heck yeah, I'll take Magnum rounds. Are you kidding me? Lid is locked. Whatever. That works for me. I don't care. Portable radar, radar receiver. I got it. Anything else I need to do? Can I leave? Oh. You're still alive. Such persistence. Nikolai? Sorry, but there is no escape from you. Try and negotiate here. So you want to get out of here alone? Is that your plan? I made certain none of the other supervisors survive. Since I'll be the only one who knows what really happened, I'll have more bargaining power when it comes to discussing my bonus. Then why kill me? I'm not on their payroll. They want to eliminate it for reasons of their own. The amount is modest, but there is a reward to be claimed upon the confirmation of your death. Although I'm sure I'll miss you, it's time to say goodbye. You can either accept death with dignity or die with regret. It's entirely up to you. Jill, what happened? Carlos, Nikolai beat us to the chopper. I guess this is it then. But I don't want to die in a place like this. This isn't over yet. I'm not giving up, Jill. We still have a chance. Jill! That's it. We've got to find a way out of here. Now! Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Warning. Missile attack confirmed. Emergency level D. 
All personnel, evacuate immediately. Well, I can't go back. Never managed to get that thing open over there. Which I don't understand why I couldn't, because I had the special facility key, but whatever. So many dead bodies. Oh. <laughs> Ow. Combine all these things. That works for a full health item thing. I know. I could pack the mind thrower with me too if I really wanted it. I'm not going to need it, though. I'm very certain if it comes down to it, if I needed it that bad, I was already screwed. Let's move. photo file. In my opinion, I feel it's too early to use this Paraclesis sword in actual fighting. However, in order to acquire the G-Virus that Umbrella has developed, it will be a great help to us. The power of the rail cannon is satisfactory, but please note that it is still having a few remaining problems. Technology Division, Colonel Franklin Hart. A rail gun? Well, can't go back. This is one of Rilla's deadly bioweapons. In it. Can I push this in? Well, let me... Oh, can I? No. Not yet. You have something on your person? No, you're just kind of dead. Power is going outside. It cannot be unlocked now. Check in system. Check in battery. Warning: There is not enough power to activate the system. Well, let's get some power going. Maybe not that one. Oh, I have to do it in sequence, don't I? Battery connected. What? What? Oh my. Oh, it's eating it. Holy hell, you look ugly. Run! 
run! Number two. Okay. I've got time. Eh. Come over here, buddy. Come over here. The cannon will fire over here. Come on. Get down here. Okay. Get up, get up, get up, Jill. Get up. <laughs> Did it hit you? Now this way. Come on! Did it hit? be dead. Finally dead. He's finally dead. Sweet. Let's get out of here. <gasps> it's still trying to get me. Bro, we are exterminating it. I had my own magnum, but that's okay. You want stars? I'll give you stars. <laughs> that one liner, though. Well, he's dead. Hooray us.
Evaluator control panel. Will you operate it? Yeah. Jill! It's over, Carlos. What are you talking about? Don't you hear that? There's a second chopper, and it's here to rescue you. But who is it? Who could possibly be looking for me? It doesn't matter. We just have to be there when it lands. Done. It's over. And now we have a rather unfortunate turn of events. It seems that the President and the Federal Council have passed judgment over the civilians of Raccoon City. The President and Federal Council have ruled that the Bacalus Terminate operation is the best course of action for this extreme situation and have since executed. Based on that fact, Raccoon City has been literally wiped off the map. Current reports have the death toll surpassing the 100,000 mark. Our hearts go out to those poor civilians of Raccoon City. You know, when you think about it, it's the only way they could really deal with it before it got worse. And that's it for Resident Evil 3 Nemesis. That was fun. I enjoyed that a lot. Even though I used every single healing item that the game gave me. So, my rank is gonna suck horribly on that regard. You know what? I don't care. I got through it. Man. Uh, I, I will pick up uh, Code Veronica X at some point, and I will play Code Veronica X because I really, 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 really want to play it. Because that's the one Resident Evil game I haven't played was Code Veronica X. So, well, I should just say Code Veronica, but I always say Code Veronica X because uh, my cousin always had the PlayStation 2 version, which is the X version. Anyway, that's going to be it for Resident Evil 3, obviously. I think I will do uh, Code Veronica X next week. I think I'll do it. Um, yeah, just to stay with the Resident Evil train for a little bit, because you know what, I, I like these games, and these are classics. But, yep, that's gonna be it, and I know there's a little thing at the end of the, uh, credits, so we'll stick around for that, but, see you guys later!
Yeah, I knew it. Save was E. Saves 12, grade E. Yeah, I knew it. Hey, Barry's in the background over there, and there's Carlos, and then there's Jill. Sweet. Ooh, I could play mercenaries with this file now. Sweet. I got... Uh, what costume did I get? Epilogue. After escaping the city, Jill set out to join Chris Redfield. However, all she found was an empty hideout of Chris's. On the floor was Chris's knife. Jill left without hesitation because she firmly believes that Chris is still alive. She will search for him until she finds him. Then they can go and put an end to Umbrella. Alright. Do I have to click... Do I have to hit something? Yeah, I did. Or did I skip that? God dang it, I think I skipped it. I think I was impatient. Yeah, I'm gonna overwrite that.